this example, we want to find the area of the red shaded region or the area of this red ring. Because this involves circles, we'll need the area formula for a circle, which is area equals pi r squared, where r is the length of the radius. We're also told to use approximately 3.14 for pi and to round the final answer to the nearest tenth. So our general strategy here is going to be to find the area of the large circle and then subtract the area of the small circle, leaving us with the area of the red ring. To look at this in more detail, let's take a look at this diagram here. Again, the idea is if we find the area of this large circle, find the area of this small circle, and then subtract the areas, it's going to leave us with the area of this blue ring or this blue shaded region. So looking at our diagram, notice how the large circle has a radius of 11 units, the length from here to here, and the small circle has a radius of 9 units from here to here. So the area of this ring is going to be approximately, because we are rounding pi, the area of the large circle, which is going to be pi or 3.14, our rounded value, times 11 squared, and then we're going to subtract the area of the small circle, which is going to be approximately 3.14 times 9 units squared. And now we'll go ahead and use a calculator to determine this. Even though this calculator does have a pi button, we'll go ahead and use 3.14. And then we have 11 squared, which is 121, or we can type in 11 in parentheses, and then here's the squared key. Let's go ahead and figure out what this would be. 379.94 square units for the area of the large circle. And then for the area of the small circle, we'd have 3.14 times 9 squared. So it's going to be 254.34 square units. And now we'll go ahead and find this difference. And then again, it does ask us to round to the tenths. Notice this difference only contains the tenths place value. So this would be our approximation for the area of the red ring or the red shaded region. 125.6 square units. Or 125 and 6 tenths square units. Okay, I hope this explanation helps.